Have you ever walked into a meeting in business and or a project and you cannot find the documentation that is associated to what has been said in that meeting? It happens to me or has happened to me many, many times. Now I'm going to give you one hint. As a project manager, there are three people or positions that walk with you. They are your blind spot mirror. The first one, and for me the most important, is your document controller. In my business, I don't call it document controllers, I call it project governors. Because a document controller, in my opinion, is a post box where a governor looks after the strategic component of documentation, governance, presentations, etc. The next person that I'm standing next to me is my project scheduler. And that document controller and the project scheduler need to work very closely with each other. Because the scheduler knows when things are happening and the document controller can then ask the scheduler for the documentation that was associated in the scheduling tasks. It just makes common sense. And the next person that stands next to me is my cost controller. Because if I have these three parties next to me, and I'm on site, I'm in meetings, they've got my back. Lastly, make sure that these three entities on your project have the correct technologies to do their work. Don't overcomplicate their lives in terms of trying to integrate every piece of technology you have in your business. Keep it simple, keep it basic, and keep it understandable for everybody on the project. Make sure that your taxonomy is set up properly and make sure that your metadata is appropriate for the project environment. And lastly, ladies and gentlemen, make sure that your document controller is at a minimum CAPM certified, certified associate, associate in project management, ISO certified in 9001-2015 or anything above that. And thirdly, corporate governance as depicted by the country that you're working in. In South Africa, it's King for Corporate Governance. Go and find out, wherever you are in the world, what those governance protocols are. Because if we understand them, our doc controllers and our governors will protect the interest of the directors. Because if they do not do their job, they're putting the organization's leadership at risk. That's how important document control and governance on a project is. Please follow the channels below and I'll see you on the next turn.